Hi friends, Amy Seifert here, speaker and author of Grace Looks Amazing on You. And today's verse comes from John 14, 1 that says, let not your hearts be troubled. Trust in God, trust also in me. These words are spoken from Jesus to his disciples. And it was right after he told them he wasn't going to be with them much longer and that Peter was going to betray him three times. And in that moment, of course the disciples feel troubled. What was Peter going to do? Where was Jesus going? What was going on? And Jesus, full of compassion, fills them with comfort with these words. And he says, don't let your hearts be troubled. But I gotta be honest, I imagine the disciples looking at each other thinking, how are we going to do that? The world is on fire. And he tells them how, he says, trust in God and trust also in me. And there's that word trust. It's the foundation of our faith. Trust is putting our confidence in something to hold us. It's leaning our whole weight onto something in certainty. One of the best wedding gifts I was ever given was from a few friends who found an old chair on the side of the road. And they took it and they reupholstered it and they gave it to us as a wedding gift. And it's one of my favorite chairs. And I've been sitting in that chair for 20 years and it has held me. And so I trust that chair. When I sit down, it will hold me for today. You can trust Jesus for today. And you can always also trust him for tomorrow too. He goes on in this passage to tell the disciples that he's going ahead of them to prepare a place in his father's house. Also, he says, I'm not going to just leave you as orphans. I'm going to give you the spirit of God, which means that Jesus right now is making a home for you. And the spirit right now is making a home in you. So today, when anxiety rises, when trouble comes, think of your favorite chair and how soft and strong it is, how it's supported you in the, in the past. And then consider Jesus. You can lean your whole weight on him. You can trust him for today and you can trust him for tomorrow.